hey 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 how y'all doing welcome back to my channel welcome back to my life you guys so in today's video you guys i will be doing a diy coffee station slash coffee bar you guys so i went over to target to get me a coffee maker i didn't get the one that i originally wanted but i went on ahead and got this hamilton beach coffee maker you guys it was only 19 dollars um hubby was just basically explaining to me baby does the same thing just get this one till you're able to get the other one y'all the other one was like 50 60 dollars so yeah hey hey what you doing hubby got my coffee machine you guys i didn't get the one that i um originally said that i wanted but it's okay because i'm gonna work with what i got until i get that one but Puppy was explaining to me, baby, do the same thing. So, yeah. So, you guys, now it's time to unbox it. You guys, I was so excited um, to open this and to try and to use it. I was so excited about um, making my little DIY coffee station. You guys, I did go to Dollar Tree and um, get some of the items that I needed. I'm sorry I didn't get a chance to show you guys because my camera was dead both batteries was dead you guys so i didn't get a chance to show you guys me spray paint everything and getting everything together and hot gluing everything well i showed you guys me hot gluing so right here i'm just trying to do like the little measurements of how i want it and everything but you guys gonna see at the end of the video that i'm gonna end up changing my mind and it's gonna be more so flat i did hot glue it but i ended up bending it a certain type of way and i just turned it y'all will see what i'm talking about <laughs> so these are some of the items that i picked up at the dollar tree i picked up uh their contact paper and i picked up that piece of wood from the dollar tree you guys i was trying to make something like real real small to sit my coffee on top of and like my sugars and creamers and stuff like that so i just thought of this idea you know as i was in the store so i'm gonna put the contact paper on there and then i'm gonna cut it a certain way then i'm gonna hot glue it to make sure it's on there really really good and yeah you guys So you guys, right here I am hot gluing my letters to my board that I bought from the Dollar Tree as well. My letters, I got those from Hobby Lobby and they was like a wood wood finish and I um spray painted them with the metallic gold spray paint and I spray painted that board black as you guys can see <laughs> but you guys um I actually enjoyed making this um I ended up adding a flower at the top y'all gonna see that at the end and you guys see that how it looks now at the end of the video you guys gonna see where I end up flattening a certain type of way and I um moved this thing around so many times you guys trying to see how I want it where I want to put it I wanted to put it on my other side of my countertop, but my microwave is in the way, so I can't do it. And the microwave up above the stove is still out. We haven't um 
I don't know you guys I just haven't sent anybody out to fix it yet <laughs> to be honest I don't know why but I just haven't did it but um it's okay but we're gonna go ahead and work with what we have what small space that we have because I really don't want it too big but I wanted it you know right and this sticky paper you guys hubby printed this out for me and I'm I ended up cutting it to make it a little bit smaller and I went on ahead and poured my Dunkin a uh, coffee blend inside of the jar <laughs> let me stop talking now